We start with developing news. Take a look at this video captured at Fresno State's sold out football game last night. Police say multiple fights broke out and five people were arrested. Our Juanita Adame spoke with the man who took this video and she joins us now in studio. Juanita. Well, Lib, Armando Gonzalez is the witness who captured that video. He talked to us today and said this video has been shared more than 10,000 times on Facebook alone. He said this is one game he won't soon forget. All I seen was punches being thrown. Armando Gonzalez was expecting to have a fun evening watching the Bulldogs play Boise State Saturday night, but instead he got this. It was crazy. It was chaos. It was just a, a fight that. It just kept escalating and, and one crazy thing happened after another. A violent fight among several people in the stands. Yes, I, I heard a whole commotion up there in the middle of the section. It happened as he and his girlfriend walked back to their seats just after halftime. But it got everybody's attention and everybody gave space and, and moved out of the way. Even though people moved, they still got brought into the chaos. Gonzalez says as the fight escalated, he pulled out his phone and began to record. It looked like it started off with just two people and then it became a brawl and there was multiple people fighting. At one point, his video captures two men falling from the bleachers and onto the field. You know, it was just the chaos, the chaos of the moment, and I knew that there was no stopping what was going on. It took some time for him to process what had happened, and after the shock of it settled, he felt something else. I, I was shocked at first, and then I guess I had a feeling of embarrassment for our city uh, that we couldn't have a good event and um, without something like that happening. And he had this message for those involved. When, when we have events like this, go out and have a good time. If you're upset about something or, or if somebody upsets you, learn to walk away. Uh, don't, let, don't let situations like this turn into what they did. Now, in all, five people were arrested facing charges of disorderly conduct and disturbing the peace. Live in the studio, Juanita Dame, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.